I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Hi. Hmm, snowman. We were just talking. Aaron doesn't uh, know how to draw numbers. No, because <laughs> we have timestamps for the show. And, uh, I'm gonna roll up a snowman planet. Please do. We have timestamps for the show to let the editors know that- Oh, by the way, we have new editors. Uh, say hello to Matt and Ryan hello, from Matt Super and Ryan. Mega. Love you guys. Uh, super cool guys. Uh, they're- they've been amazing. They've been editing for a couple weeks now, I think. Mm -hmm. Um, adding in some, like, little edited bits and stuff just to- Just to warm up. Uh, flex their little editing muscles. Um, they're actually quite large. I've seen them mm -hmm. work out. It's it's quite quite amazing. And we love you, Kevin. We love and miss you. And oh yeah, yeah. Kevin's uh, Kevin's Ke out. Kevin uh, has moved on. Yeah. Um, which is totally cool. Uh, he he likes uh cutting trailers, so we didn't have much trailer work for him. It's very good point. It's a very <laughs> so, good point. <laughs> he really wanted to get into that game. So uh, all the best. Uh, best wishes. Um. He's and, not uh, dead. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll be hanging out with him. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah. Uh, just for the just for the sake of the audience, though. Just you know, mm -hmm. best wishes. Everyone wish for Kevin a, a great, uh, great new career in in cutting trailers. Hope hopefully he'll get the uh, the the position he wants. Um, Missionary. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no. Matt, Matt and Ryan from Super Mega are editing, and they're they're super cool. And uh, you might have seen them in a lot of our social media lately. Um, because they're fucking hilarious. Yeah, they are funny. And, uh, they've been adding in all these little bits. So hopefully <laughs> they'll- they'll be a bit right here. Look at that. Whoa, what a bit. Wow, that's crazy. Dang. My favorite thing about them, <clears throat> uh, one of my favorite things about them, is that they sexually harass each other constantly. They're both young, straight males, but, um, they, uh, well, it's like you got your snowball a little fez hat. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, um, I'm Randy Snowball. Uh, whoop. What was I gonna say? Oh yeah, they sexually harass each other constantly, uh, to amuse everybody else. And then they've told me that there have been many occasions where, uh, they'll just start, like, sexually harassing each other and getting inappropriate, and then come to realize that there's no one else there to watch it, and they're like, Are we- are we just gay? <laughs> we might just be gay people. Which yeah. is fine. Uh, I don't know, I mean- It's cool, guys. Entertaining each other, both in on the joke, right? Yeah, I mean, yeah. Right? <laughs> Just two guys. Whatever floats your boat. Knocking each other's junk around. <laughs> Knocking each other's dicks. Straight to the ground, dude. Straight to the ground. Just down, down into the ground. Hanging low and lazy. Hanging low. Keeping that low hanging fruit. Oh, that was a snowboard. Yeah, yeah. All right. I did not pick up on that. Am I just like. This is a really relaxed. Are you picking up snow as you go? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to get uh, this snowman to be the perfect size. Mm. So, like, that's- that's the thing, and I gotta make my head really huge. I think I should just speed it up, really. Yeah, so... Wait, t So that big ball in the center. Oh, it's a Yeti. I have to make it the perfect size head for a snowman. Oh, just the head? Yeah. Okay. So I guess Japanese snowmen are too high. American snowmen are three high. Oh! Yeah. I thought... Like, I just misunderstood. When you were like, Japanese snowmen are too high, I was like... Too high for what? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just a body and a head, I guess. Too high to drive? Because I know that feeling. Which honestly makes more sense to me personally, because it's like what, the snowmen have like big thick feet? I don't get it. They're not like a they're not like an ant where they have like a thorax and an abdomen. It's a good point. It's, it's just a point. body and a head. I think head. it was just so the snow wouldn't fall. I feel like it's harder to stack three snowballs on top of each other than two snowballs. I don't know, man. I mean, maybe it's, that's just the weeb in me, and I fucking I love Japan and everything about it, and then... I know, I just know I fucking miss snow. <laughs> like, I, I... As we're having this conversation, it's occurring to me that I haven't... made a fucking snowman in many, many years. I miss snow until I see snow again. Right. And then I'm like, it's cold, <laughs> and I'm in pain, I can't feel my ears, mm -hmm. I hate this. There is that. Um, and then I immediately get out of the snow, and then I'm like, oh, what a treat. Huh. That was- that was so, so pleasant. That's, I loved it. That's pretty neat. It, it's weird how that immediately changes. Yeah. God, this is- This is tedious. Going real slow. <laughs> yeah. I, I think it's because the- the- Is it my imagination or is the- the- 
the level really small. It is. Okay. I'm just I'm just moving in a circle. Yeah. I'm trying to get big enough to roll shit up to to you know save me some time. Oh, there you go. Is this you really think as soon as the first three people got sucked up by the rolling giant snowball that continuously comes around, everyone else would have uh, gotten off the line. But you know. Not, oh, I'm tired. I can't. I can't roll when I'm tired like yeah. that. Oh shit. Oh, weird. Is that new? I don't know. That must have been what was happening before, too. When I couldn't roll anymore? Yeah. You were just, like, getting weak I'm because fine. you were pushing so many SEALS! <laughs> <laughs> Are you a SEALS fan? Yes. Uh, were you kissed by a rose recently? I was. Ooh. The more I get of you, the stranger it feels you. I wish there was a sports team called the SEALS. They would be adorable. They would be ad Actually, there was. There was a hockey team in, like, the 70s called the California Golden Seals or something like that? Really? Something like that. I think they played in San Francisco. Huh. The Golden Seals. Is that right? Hold on. I'm gonna look it up. That they sounds more like a, like a seal you'd put on a letter or something. <laughs> <laughs> or like an envelope. That's a really good point. The Golden Seals. I don't think there's a Golden Seal in the wild, is there? And if there were, then that is some fucking D&D &D shit. <laughs> Whoa. This is interesting. Seek out the golden sea. <laughs> what is interesting? This picture. Because it's so 70s that, like, it just... It, they were the Oakland... No, the California Golden Seals. Wow, I had it right. Oh, my God. This is fucking adorable. Look at this symbol. Oh, it's a little seal. It's a little green and yellow seal. Wait, why was it California? There's no fucking seals here. Uh, it was like a Lakers situation where like Alaska gave up their team. I don't know. Oh my god, these are adorable! I wish this team still existed. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> little seals. Put up the logos. Yeah. Wow, oh. those are adorable. Those are so cute. Um, man, hockey was cute in the seventies. <laughs> hockey was a way to pick up chicks in the seventies. Ch -ch chicks. Now it's just lame. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure they get chicks still. Oh. In fact, I wasn't there that, um, yeah, there was. There was a controversy, because Sean Avery, who is a hockey player and also a notorious douchebag, um, was dating Elisha Cuthbert from 24. Okay. The That's daughter. the daughter, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, uh, I think she started dating another hockey player, and so Sean Avery went on, um, uh, he, he was, like, in an interview, and he was like, well, that guy's getting my sloppy seconds. Or like some like fucked up shit like that. And I was like, whoa! And in hockey, there's this culture of like respect and like you just don't talk. And like, that's why every time you see a hockey player being interviewed, he's like, oh, well, you know, you try to. You know, like they speak very quietly uh -huh. and like, uh, the, the respect, there's like a code that they all follow. And that was outside of the code. Wow, no yeah. way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or the balls on that guy. Sheesh. Well. Yeah. No, what are you gonna do? What an asshole. Yeah. It was fun. <laughs> hey, question. Yeah. Why does the snowman in the corner keep changing size? Uh, because that's the size that my head would be. Oh. If I put it on right now. So that's pretty good, right? I, I do, do you think? Do you this think? This looks like a good size snowman yeah. head. But you don't have a time limit, I think do it you? might be a little- no, I don't. That's the thing, is I have to decide when it's good enough. That looks pretty fucking... Yeah, do you think it's good enough? Right? I mean, maybe a little bigger? Maybe I'll just do one more lap around. Sure. Yeah, I think that'll be good. I, I mean, I think I like the song, so... <laughs> sort of... <laughs> I think I like the ski resort. I wanna hang out yeah. here. Yeah! Looks like fun. You know, I, I only lived in New Hampshire... from when I was like two to three, maybe when I was four. Mm -hmm. But like... I remember it so vividly. And like stuff like this reminds me of living up there. Oh, totally. Uh, oh! Yeah. Time yeah. to go in, Burr. Burr. How do you stand it? High tech underwear? You better believe it, bro. That's that's that was one of the only episodes I ever saw of the original Batman. It's not the high tech eat. underwear. It's the heat of my meat. <laughs> Sorry, one. Batman and Robin went into Mr. Freeze's chamber, and he was like, Ah, one of you will have to stand under the cold meter, and you'll die, freeze to death, and. Batman and Robin, Robin's like, I'll do it, Batman, you're more important, and Batman's like, no, I'll do it, I'm the hero, and then he's like, aha, one of you must, and then Batman does it, and then, and he's like, yes, yes, and then Batman's like, good thing I wore my 
cold protective underwear today. Oh, yeah. And then he's the like, old Batman no. used to do that shit all the time. Oh, look at that. Yeah, Fucking perfect dude. score. Nice. Holy shit. Funny head. Snowman can't exactly be graded any other way, except for a funny head. Yep. Wasn't there a present? And it's try again? Who turned this into a prize draw? It wasn't us. Yeah, All right, well, cool. Wasn't Batman attacked by sharks and he's like, Robin, reach for my shark, shark repellent on my yeah. utility belt. That was from the movie, I think, Yes, wasn't it? yes it is. And then the same with like the famous bomb scene. I don't know that one. Where he's like running with the bomb, the giant black bomb. Like a- oh, episode 5, he's up. Tornadoes around the world, everyone's dying. Oh, shit! <laughs> I better run. <laughs> yeah. Yay! I better build a typhoon protective wall. Oh, this is adorable. I want her to be my wife. <laughs> I'm sorry, Susie. She is she in your five? She's in five. <laughs> in the cosmos is in my man king. five. Nice, dude. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. It's That's like, an angry looking off snowman. Off Get the fuck off me! Jesus. I like the little dog snowman too. Yeah, pretty snow dog. <laughs> oh shit! Rush reference. Okay. There we go. I just didn't have a free hand. That's okay. Was that a rush reference? No. Oh. Next time on Game Grumps? Dang. I didn't even know. Yeah, Bytor and the Snow Dog is one of their famous compositions. Tell me what Batman was doing with the bomb before we go. He was running away. He was trying to dispose of it. Mm -hmm. So he had a big like black bomb with like a fuse on it, and he was like running through town. There's this really famous. Clip of him like just running through town with a big black bomb. It's like, this is the, oh geez, get out of the way, folks. The movie is fucking absurd. It's really hilarious, and I love it. Will you love it more next time on Game Room? Hey, Luigi, Mario. Oh, what are we doing, Mario?